Okay, what we have here is a Cobra 25 LTD Classic. This is the same radio I had on the meter earlier. Um, I was, uh, was only getting uh, <clears throat> a one and a half wide dead key, uh, <clears throat> swinging up to like 10 on a whistle. I was lucky to get 18 watts, uh, a little bit below 20 watt mark. This is the scale over here. Sorry, this is the scale right here. I'm on the 100 watt scale. You can see I'm on the 100 watt scale. Okay, uh, this isn't a happy meter or anything. This meter is, is pretty accurate. <clears throat> I tested with other stuff before. Um, I do want to upgrade and get another uh, Dossy, Dozy, whatever you want to call it, another another meter. <clears throat> it's going to show you what I'm dead keen at now. I did uh, some playing around with inside the radio. Uh, took out a couple of caps, uh, moved some parts around. I'm running a 520 uh, MOSFET in it right now. This radio came, uh, wasn't working when I got it. This was a, uh, as I stated on the other video, this was a, uh, there was a 1969, I believe, in here. They had the uh, <clears throat> capacitor in here. They did that, uh, the mod swing. It was dead keen at like barely one watt, swinging a, to like two and a half. It really had no, uh, no RF power whatsoever. Uh, I couldn't even set it up on the, I couldn't even set the modulation up uh, on, the, on this gauge here. I wouldn't even go into the red to set it. Uh, you can see it's swinging now. Uh, like I said, there's some playing around with it. It works pretty well. Uh, I'm going to probably eBay this radio. It's a good test radio for me. I want to. Maybe I might even do a uh, look into doing a uh, receive uh, upgrade like the 29 uh, with the uh, Scotty's diodes. I have to figure out which ones to change or what whatnot. Just to show you uh, what I'm dead keying at now, and it shows you that you can get. You're getting the 25, 35 watts out of these MOSFETs. Um, I've seen guys getting more. I've seen guys getting more without even whistling, getting 35 watts. I uh, don't know how they did it, but uh, I'll figure it out. Okay. okay. There you can see your 6 watt dead key. Um, the mic gain, I believe, is all the way up. I'm running a, this is a, a diesel microphone, a diesel noise canceling mic. It does have settings on the back. My camera works. It's about five, it's halfway, a little more than halfway, or about halfway. Okay. Audio. Audio. One, two, three. One, two, three. Radio. Audio. Okay. Well, you can see she's basically, um, basically swinging from, uh, I'd say, six watts to twenty. Um, it might even do twenty-five watts. Sometimes it'll peak a little bit past twenty. Um, but. Uh, it's pretty good. I'm getting about uh, 30 watts on a whistle, and she's like she's swinging 20, 25 watts, uh, easy. Um, I'm not screaming into the mic right now. It's away from my it's away from my face, about a uh, good uh, six inches, and uh, she's still swinging a uh, good 20 watts on a, on an on audio. <clears throat> My meter's hooked up. I got it working pretty well now. Um, there you go. There's the audio. Oh, audio, audio. There's the audio on the uh, scale. Audio one two three one two three radio. Audio one two one two three. And that's it. Uh, you can see dead can. So she's looking. You're pushing about uh, almost. Uh, everything's turned up pretty much. So somebody like a little over 100. 100 uh, percent audio it's almost it's about 200 percent so that's pretty much it just wanted to show you this little rig it does uh, i could squeeze it to do 30 on a whistle and it'll do a uh, 20 25 watts with the audio and that's just basically uh with that uh, 520 uh final in it mm -hmm. doing all the work all right 73s